Liverpool has a really rich and varied architectural history. There are loads of great buildings all over the city, all kinds of amazing stuff. Your best bet is to get out there and see things for yourself. But obviously there are some great buildings that have been knocked down or bombed and that you can't really see anymore. Liverpool did get bombed a lot in the Second World War, you see. Most people my age have heard stories of the Blitz from their parents or grandparents. The Germans bombed Liverpool a lot because it was such an important port city. But most of the bomb sites have been cleaned up now. I'm not so keen on a lot of the modern buildings we have. The Liverpool waterfront's been given world heritage status. You have the Liver buildings, the Cunard building and the old Port of Liverpool building, which are all really striking, iconic things. They've got a nickname, the Three Graces. But then to the north of them, just opposite St Nicholas's Church, you've got some ugly hotels and car parks. They just spoil things. On the other side, you've got the Museum of Liverpool Life. That's not too bad, but there's a weird black building in front of that that looks like the Death Star and it's got nothing to do with anything else down there at all. 